Well, I'm back from my little hiatus, everyone. It is a brand new year. We are in 2024 now. I hope everybody had a great New Year's and a great Christmas. My first intention was to get some uploads out there for you guys during the month of December, but some family matters and health and stuff had to take priority, and I wanted to enjoy the Christmas season a little bit, and a lot of the YouTube stuff got pushed to the back burner, unfortunately. I had some plans to get some videos out, especially for Christmas. I wanted to at least get one GoGo's video out, and I wanted to get the O'Neill review. We had the new wave just drop back, I think like two weeks before Christmas or something. I got mine in a week before Christmas Eve, and I was supposed to have that out for you guys for the holiday, but that didn't happen. It w I did get partially filmed. I didn't do the intro, so tomorrow you guys will see the O'Neill wave review that will be a lot of fun pretty cool stuff in that wave so i hope you guys enjoy that one we also had a new cappy drop with some amazing new little mischievous characters uh, it, i was stoked for this one my order took super long to get in because of the holidays and stuff too so unfortunately that one just came in like literally four days ago it took an extra long time but i'm really looking forward to going over those figures now that's the glio side of things i still have lots of plans for crazy bone content we are finally starting to see some pkxd the new series uh, that came out over in brazil last year we're starting to see that come over to the us now get out to some people a friend of mine that is hooking me up with the box for the PKXD. He just got his in. That would be I Like Go Go's Crazy Bones. If you haven't checked him out, go check out his channel. He already has an unboxing up for PKXD. So as soon as he gets me mine, I'll be doing an unboxing as well. But in the meantime, you can get a little bit of your new Crazy Bone fix. Go check out his channel and check out his new unboxing. So I'm really looking forward to that. Want to jump back into series one because I know everybody loves series one and looking for the hunt for the rest of the checklist, the master set. And I really have been itching to get into some class again but man oh man uh this this whole break has been pretty nice and relaxing uh it really opened my eyes to how much time i actually do spend editing and filming every given week uh it definitely felt like it was taking up a lot more time from my family my kids and everything than i had realized so it was kind of a weird little hiatus of figuring out the balancing act what i wanted to do going forward because i was really enjoying the freed up time I had from not worrying about editing videos and such and things like that. So going forward, I don't plan on making like changes. I'm not like going to try to reduce uploads. Uh, I still want to do twice a week or weekly videos, depending. I at least want to get one out every week like I typically was last year. I think the exception was just December was just one of those months where I had to take a step back for a minute. But I want to get the ball rolling again. I want to get back onto the editing grind a bit and just make sure I'm balancing everything out how I need to for my family to still have me available for things. And I, I also was getting obsessed with other little hobbies. You know, I'm, I'm ADHD and I just love too many cool collectible things. So most of my December was filled with reinvigorating my love for Gunpla and Gundam model kits. I've only done a couple but I really just went for it in December since I had free time with family and stuff. I was building kits with my son and doing all sorts of stuff like that. Oh, goodness. I'll show you in a clip here. I went through all these boxes and made a bunch of different figures. And I've got a couple more on the way, too, that I'm really looking forward to opening up, maybe doing a video from. The last time I did a Gundam video on the channel, it didn't go over super great. But if there is interest, please let me know in the comments below. I would love to do maybe like a Gunpla building live stream. Uh, where I take a box and just start building it, chat with you guys or something, or if, or if you want to see more of the review side of things like I typically do with the Glios verse, I could do it for Gunpla too. That might be interesting. I can't guarantee I'll be on top of all the new Gunpla drops, Gundam drops and things. Uh, I'm just going to be taking that hobby a little bit more slow, getting kit by kit kind of thing, taking my time with it. It was a nice relaxing thing to do. It was definitely a good de-stressor. But again, I've just been hooked on that this whole month. So if there is re-interest or more interest, uh, if you're new to the channel and you want to see some Gundam stuff, I love it. I do a lot of the Converge. I did Converge in the past, but getting into the main line model kits is really, really cool. Just got my first real grade and I'm already scoping out a master grade. So 
we'll see how that goes. Anyways, just wanted to do a quick little update before I did a regular scheduled post video, uh, just to kind of give you guys a little bit of a quick recap of my December and Christmas season and what I've been doing and to let you guys know what is going to be happening going forward. I appreciate all the continued support even through my hiatus. There were still so many people commenting on videos giving me a lot of kind words and things. It was it was really nice and really kind and I greatly appreciate it. Um, I, I'm, I'm really looking forward to the rest of January here and getting back going. So if you haven't subscribed and you're just seeing this channel and this video for the first time, make sure to subscribe and consider doing it if you enjoy collecting hobbies from Crazy Bones Nostalgia to Goliath's Verse, awesome custom line toys. And if you know, if you have the interest in the Gundam stuff, go there too. We're also opening up TCGs occasionally now still. Still got Force of Will boxes sitting on the shelf over there. Have a great rest of your day. Stay tuned tomorrow for the video review of the O'Neill drop, and we'll catch you guys in the next video.